I'm Jessica Dean with your evening digital news brief for Wednesday, April 18th. The National Transportation Safety Board has released new information from the flight data recorder of a plane that made, made an emergency landing in Philadelphia yesterday. Investigators say once the left engine failed, the aircraft quickly rolled to the left. The pilot was able to level out the plane, but vibrations could be felt for the remaining 22 minutes of the flight. The NTSB is carefully examining the blown out window, among other things, in that row where one passenger was killed. In an effort to make things right after two controversial arrests at a Center City Starbucks last week, executives from the company are meeting with members of the community. Starbucks Executive Director Howard Schultz and others met with community and religious leaders at Mother Bethel AME Church and Society Hill today. Some of the dialogue during the more than 90 minute meeting focused on the additional training all 175,000 U.S. Starbucks employees will go through on May 29th. Police are searching for this man. They think he may be connected to the attack of a 66-year-old woman inside her Ridley Township neighborhood. Officers say she was physically assaulted Saturday night along the 700 block of Michelle Street. Police say they've received some tips from the public about the person of interest, but no arrests have been made. Getting geared up for Game 4, Flyers Faithfuls could be seen picking up shirts and beads today ahead of the team's pivotal playoff matchup at home against the Pittsburgh Penguins. The Orange and Black are looking to even their best of seven series. And remember, you can always get the latest on these stories and more right here on CBSPhilly.com. For the Evening Digital Brief, I'm Jessica Dean.